Days on, you know, now that you're near the end of your UCF year here, I think this year has made you a better player. Uh, I feel like it just made me a better leader. Uh, I'm the one who always try to keep the team together, uh, just from a point guard's perspective and uh, as an older player. What does tomorrow mean to you, knowing that it's you know, season night and it's last game to play in regular season college basketball? Uh, it means a lot. Uh, I, mean, I just want to thank all my coaches and my teammates for allowing me to come in and try to lead the team. But, you know, we had some ups and downs this year, and we're not finished though. As a senior, I mean, do you, have you kind of been thinking like this is maybe the last home game we're going to have? This is kind of the, the end of my college career. Is that something that you continue to think about kind of in the back of your mind here last week or two? Uh, I mean, as a, as a regular season game, yes. But I know we're not finished. So we got unfinished business. Do you guys feel confident, especially if you win it tomorrow? Do you guys feel confident you would have momentum going into the next week? Oh, uh, absolutely. Uh, I know what this team's looking for. Uh, we, we show spurts of it this year, this season. And I, we just got to be more consistent with it. What did you see from a guy like Tony Johnson? You were out for a couple games a little bit under the weather. You kind of stepped up in some of those games. What did you see from the young guy? Uh, Tony's a killer. Uh, I know I know that from back in high school. I know him for a while now. Uh, and I know what he, knew what he was capable of. And he came in, stepped up in, in a, a huge environment. Uh, going into Cincinnati and, and winning, helping and leading the team. Now, was that the game you were back at home? Did you travel to that game? I didn't. So were you watching or were you? Oh yeah, I was watching the game. <laughs> so what was, kind of, what was your reaction? You were usually on the court watching the game on TV and seeing that game go to double overtime and everything. What was kind of your reaction back then? I was like, I was just going crazy, man. Uh, I, was just proud of, I was just proud of the way the team fought. Uh, so Tony, like I said, he did a good job of leading and keeping the game under control. He really controlled the game. Now both of you guys are from Alabama. I know you're obviously a lot older than him. You said you kind of knew of him. Like, did you your teams play each other? Or you just kind of knew about him coming through the like AAU circuit? Or uh, he played he played against my little brother. Okay. <laughs> but he said he he used to watch me growing up. So that's how that's how I know. And then he came to Alabama camp when I was there. Okay. When you saw Tony then and you see Tony now, like what stands out to you about how his game maybe has changed? Uh, his, his game's changed a lot. Uh, he got he, he's gotten a lot bigger, uh, and he he's a lot faster now, and he's stronger, so he can finish through contact with all of them. What are the keys tomorrow against East Carolina? I know it's been a little while since you played those guys, but you know, coach said they they've improved and they're playing really well right now. What will be the keys to victory tomorrow? Uh, we just got to come out and play with energy, like we did the last game. Uh, we got to put, put together a defensive masterpiece, and we just got to stop Gardner. Talk about Jaden Gardner, like, what is that match going to be like one-on-one -on -one with him? I assume you see him at some point out there on the perimeter. Uh, that's my matchup. Yeah. Uh, so, we don't want him to come in here again, scoring 35 and getting 20 boards. So, we try to uh, make sure we can uh, key in it on him as much as possible. What makes him so difficult? Uh, he's strong. He, his, his first step is super quick. So he's a good, strong right, right hand driver. So gotta make sure I cut that off. Good stuff, man. Appreciate it. Thanks a lot, man. Good luck to you.